We're shaking, folks. Back with another reaction. Back with some more Duran Duran. And we're going back to their 2004 album, Astronaut. Um, very excited for this one. This is a track a number of you have mentioned that you're very fond of. Uh, so yeah, we're up to the tune Chains. Um, yeah, it's interesting. I was trying to think, you know, if there's much that I can make of this admittedly sort of opaque single word title. It did remind me there's, you know, some movies with characters named Chains. There's this old school, like, ridiculous action movie, and Lance Henriksen is in it, and his character name is Chains, and he's sort of this badass crazy guy. Um, but yeah, bottom line, um, it's tough to make uh, much of that. I suppose, like, Chains, like, conceptually, you know, they connect things, they link one, you know, end to another, and they are themselves comprised of links, you know, individual connections leading to a larger conduit. Um, now, but at the same time, chains can be used as barriers, so yeah, it's like they're linked together, but they're also designed to prevent, you know, passage into an area, um, whether it's, you know, from people um, or otherwise. So yeah, chains can bind also, they can wrap things up and, you know, keep them um, in possession and keep them held tightly. So yeah, I suppose chains can do many different things. Fair to say, like, in general, chains, whether, you know, as part of a chain link fence or a literal, like, metal chain, it, it feels like a tough, like, hard, like, substance. It's not something that's like, you know, if you're going to wrap someone up with it or if you're going to, like, you know, use it to, like, um, cordon off an area, it's a very severe kind of um, harsh, like, heavy substance. It's not like, you know, wrapping someone in ribbon or something like that. So, I don't know, it, it gives me a sort of tough and potentially um, like hard sort of feeling, but also it also it speaks to um, connections or links or you know binding things. Um, so yeah, there's a number of different ways it can go. Which again, this always um, illustrates why single word titles are a bit harder to get at because you know even if they suggest different interpretations, you know you don't have much context and you know, figured out how that's going to manifest. So let's get to it. This is Duran Duran, Astronaut, and the tune is Chains. <laughs> Just can't let go. It's 
partly the lines that I'm picking up. It's like, it's a moving song. track sometimes it gets a moment and it really shines it's like a bass solo or it just kind of really drives a like instrumental interlude but there are times where the bass it's like supportive it's sort of you know the the foundation that everything else can sort of launch from so yeah um, it felt like that track it was serving more of that role though right toward the end I was sort of picking up on it more so again uh, shout out to the guys fantastic tune I really do get why that was one uh, that a number of people were waiting for it had this very like dreamy but also kind of like I don't know what the what the appropriate word is like you're sort of like drifting at the mercy of the winds of the song so it's like dreamy and floaty but you're like out of control a little bit um, and yeah the lyrics were interesting I you know several of them I think were sort of profound and moving even without fully being able to put all the pieces together but I am fascinated by the line about you know putting your hand in the flame and it's burned but you don't feel any pain you know, there's because it at first it was making me think of the that you know nine inch nails line from hurt the like I hurt myself today to see if I could still feel to see like you know am I so like just jaded and sort of withdrawn that like you know I don't even get hurt with physical pain um but yeah in this case it's literally he's saying that there's no pain so I'm sort of curious about that aspect so uh, let me know if you have any insight let me know uh, your interpretations of the song uh, definitely got to listen to it again but very cool that that's Again, you know, it's hard because I'm going through a few different albums and sometimes I feel like my wires get crossed. It's like, oh, this, maybe I like that other tune better. Wait, that other tune was on a different album. Um, but this is definitely one of the best ones on the album so far. I really did enjoy that. So let me know what you think. I will see you next time. Peace. <laughs>